Hi, it's Deanna. And so just now, actually it's 7.30 in the morning, my doorbell rang and this arrived. So um, this little vintage teddy bear that's German in origin uh, actually came all the way from here and I'll show you. Let's see if you can guess. It came all the way from England and I think that's so cool. And the funny part is, is that it came quicker than most of the packages that I order from American sellers and I live in America. So what does that tell you? That tells you that something's going on with our postal system as opposed to theirs. Theirs is actually really good. The Royal Mail. It's very royal. So what do we have here today? So we have a bear known as Zadi or a Zadi style bear. And in previous videos, oh, by the way, there's my dog in the background, video bombing. Hi, uh, hey, Grover, say hi. Okay. So yeah, he wants the bear. That's what it really comes down to. He, uh, every time I take one of these bears out of the boxes, he wants it and he hovers around thinking that it's his toy and that I ordered him something from the internet. Not happening. So, okay, so this bear is a Zadi style bear. It was made by Herman in Germany, probably somewhere between the late 1950s and the late 1960s. And he's a Zadi face bear, but he's not Zadi. And so the down low on that is Zadi bears were created in 1951 by Steiff, a German company making mohair animals and teddy bears. And Zadi was actually a really popular style because he had this beautiful open mouth and other German manufacturers started to copy it right after that. And Herman being one of them made beautiful Zadi style bears. And let me show you him. He has gorgeous amber eyes. I don't know if you can see them. And they're made out of glass. And you hear my dog, he's crying in the background because he wants this bear and he knows he's not getting it. So he has little four, um, four pads made out of felt and mohair. And it's a nice color mohair. It's almost uh, tipped in different colors. It looks frosted. And he has a bristly nose. Oh, there he is again. See him? What's the matter, boy? You can't have the bear. I'm sorry, I can't give it to you. I'll order you your own teddy bear, I promise. So, um, yeah, for Christmas, you know what? He's gonna get a teddy bear. I'm gonna order him a little, cute little teddy bear that he can just like snuggle with. I can't do this. It makes my it breaks my heart. Hey, can you imagine this? Um, it's breaking my heart because my dog is sad right now. But that's because I love him. So yeah, so this guy is really cute. He's all jointed. So he um, can be posed in a number of different um, poses. So his legs, arms, and head swivel. And uh, he has no tags or um, any kind of uh, button in his ear like Stife does. Um, he's missing his identification. But I do know he is Herman, as I collect Herman Zadi style bears. And so it looks like the lady in England gave him a little silk bow, which is adorable. And uh, she gave him a really nice plaid color bow that actually looks good on him. That color is great. And uh, so here's what he does. So let's see if it works. I don't know. And it does. And this is what usually makes my little dog go even crazier. Uh-huh. <laughs> all right, all right, buddy, all right. Uh, you saw they came bounding into the kitchen, right? Well, I can't do anything about that. I can't, honey, I can't. Aw, he's actually looking at me from the floor right now with these sad little eyes. I'm sorry, buddy. I know, I'm a bit of a sadist. All right, that's it. No more squeaking the bear. So, yeah, so I thought I'd share this guy with you. And if you like what you see, hit the thumbs up and subscribe. And uh, let's see. Want the bear? Do you want the bear? Aw. All right. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.